Pakistan has opened its first transgender-only madrasa which will teach students how to read the Quran and other life skills. The Islamic school, which is based in Pakistan's capital Islamabad, was set up by Rani Khan, according to Reuters. Speaking to the news publication, Khan, 34, described the discrimination the transgender community often faces in Pakistan. In October, the 34-year-old opened a small madrasa open to the transgender community. I'm teaching the Quran to please God, to make my life here and in the hereafter, she said explaining why she chose to open the school. While mosques and madrasas are central locations for prayer, education, and worship, there is little recognition of the LGBTQ community in Pakistan. Currently, across Pakistan, same-sex marriage or relations are criminalized under the Penal Code 1860 and are deemed culturally taboo. Khan's religious school is a self-funded project which receives no governmental backing to stay open. Pakistan recorded over 10,000 transgender people in 2017, while community-based organizations believe there are close to half a million transgender people in the. Most families do not accept transgender people. They throw them out of their homes. Transgender people turn to wrongdoing, Khan, 34, said, as other transgender people, their heads similarly covered, swayed back and forth behind her, reciting Quran verses. At one time, I was also one of them. Holding back tears, Khan recalled how she was disowned by her family at 13 and forced into begging. At 17, she joined a transgender group, dancing at weddings and other functions, but quit it to connect with her religion after a dream in which a deceased transgender friend and fellow dancer pleaded with her to do something for the community. Khan studied the Quran at home and attended religious schools, before opening the two-room madrasa in October.